Rental is a short and spooky adventure game about the dangers of renting a house in an unknown place. Such is the description of this short horror journey. So let's immerse and take a closer look. Press to play. It looks like to be a PlayStation X era. With a bunny family and a bouncing car. <laughs> Hello. Ah, enter. Dad, what do you think, Umi? It's not too shabby. This feels a little bit like Animal Crossing. <laughs> like, <laughs> um, well, I haven't had a good look at the house yet. I think it's the one up, uh, up to the left here. This here? Looks like a, f a farm shed. How about you? Bro, <laughs> did you want to play with me? No. <laughs> and mom says, the door is open. Could the rental man already be here? A shimmer and lock speak to all your family. Our good old Suzuki carry. A dancing Suzuki carry. So family want to be supportive, wants to see my new house. Let's have an exterior look first. Can we look back here? Ah, only the protagonist may see. Apparently not noteworthy. I also like how the windows are just pitch black. So let's see. Oh, that's loud. Who closed the door? Hey, open up. But I'm the one inside. It won't open. <laughs> well, yeah, it shouldn't. It shouldn't be locked from the outside, like that. Um, I should find that dental, a rental, a rental man, dental. <laughs> Those are two very different things. Oh, looked like we walked into the door there. Um, okay, so you don't want to comment on the environment before you find the rental man, I guess. Fine. Let's do that then. Oh, dental man. Is it appropriate to call this man a dentist now? There's a bathroom. A very green bathroom. I thought this one was more old fashioned. We used to have an old, oh, hello, there, there is someone at least. We used to have a green bathroom when I grew up. Rental man says, yo, did you come from the outside? Yeah, everyone eventually comes from the outside, even insects from the walls. So, not comparing myself with an insect here, but <laughs> I've been trapped here for weeks, months. I don't even know anymore. So is this a haunted house then, or, or what? Umi says, I need to get the keys. My parents are outside. <laughs> Umi doesn't care for the, for whatever this rental man says apparently. Forget about your parents. You'll never see them again anyway. So I, so we are both stuck in here now. Unless, unless what? You'll have to perform a ritual to exercise this cursed place. Yes, that's it. I can't do it myself, of course. Why? You're not the landlord or anything. <laughs> I'm just some helpless rental man. <laughs> helpless. But you, you're a little girl. Who else could do it better? This is... Not the best way to escape a situation. Umi, uh, rental man says, you just need to find the artifacts. It's, uh, let me see. Well, you've been stuck here for months. Why does the little girl have to find the artifacts? You're scared of something, obviously. Six crosses, a woman behind bars, some angry man. No, not me. You don't seem angry. You just seem upset and confused. Three candles, and then... <laughs> what the hell was that? Um, oh, wait, I think you should know. I think you should know that I was the ghost all along. There appears to be a secret room somewhere in here. I don't know how to summon it, but some of the stuff is probably there. Good luck. <laughs> what the hell? What is this even? Nothing here. Looks like a good place to hide. Uh -huh, under the bed, you mean?
Okay, the steps are mine. The steps are mine. I was wondering, like, is someone walking around at the same time as me? I wonder if 90DF is on. What is 90DF? But the TV looks kind of fuzzy. Yeah, that typically means no signal in an analog way. So old CRT. There's nothing in the drawer. Ah, cross. Ha, ah, this one was easy. It's a big one. Pound cross. I can use this to reach high places. A wooden stool. Used to one stool immediately. That was easy. Uh, there's nothing in there anyway. Okay. That's the time for a hot bath, she says, looking at the toilet. Okay, so what else? There's a woman behind, not behind bars, but some random woman with a baby. Okay, yeah. <laughs> ah, this texture looks so meaty. Uh, it does. You could have had that opinion to yourself. It looks quite meaty. There's always stuff between the cushions. Found a candle. Okay, so you reached in between the cushions to check. The table is floating. I just noticed now, yeah. The table is floating. Fair enough. Fair enough? Why fair enough? And this, this demonic sound as well. No problem here. The windows look kind of low budget. I think the game is self-aware at this point. <laughs> I think they went for a low budget experience. But it's still, uh, of course, eerie. What's in here? Oh. Found two candles. Or the second one. I don't feel so well. We are trapped in here indeed. I guess when uh, the dentist, if we can call him that, tried to escape, he felt the same way. As if it was trapped. No problem here. Problem. Four chairs, huh? My little brother should should eat outside. <laughs> little brother is too uh, mischievous. No dirty dishes here. Is that what you... Oh, used the wooden stool to reach the cupboard. Some cross object here. And a refrigerator. Uh-huh. Wow, well, that's weird. That's quite weird indeed. What's this on the wall here? There's a man, but he doesn't doesn't look angry. It looks very religious. There's a woman, but she's not behind bars. There's some ugly kid too. You don't like children, even though you're a child yourself. Well, maybe not child. You're out to live on your own. So, uh, so young adult. Oh my God! What the? Okay, that 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 just goes to show that you don't need budget to make something scary. That was horrifying. That was an elongated shadow of myself or something. Slender bunny. Oh. Oh. Now this guy looks angry enough. Looks like an. Angry Jesus Christ. Found angry man. The windows look kind of low budget. They look kind of dark. Ah! Oh! Aha! It's static there, but it don't do that. Oh my God, I hate that. Oh my God, I hate that. That is so airy. <laughs> I don't do well with ghosts. It's not the time to take a nap. What's a question mark though? Because of this, I think. Yeah, okay. God, ghosts can just manifest at will and just... Then they're gone again. Oh, I hate it. Oh. A woman behind bars. Weird taste in decoration, but good taste in letting me finish my puzzles. So, is it what it really is? A woman in prison? What is it? What even? I don't even know. I don't even know. Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I hate that so much. I hate that so much. The rental man didn't even make a notice of it. A note of it. I would have assumed that 
the rental man. Once there's a clock, I guess. The rental man would have once he saw a living fellow. Oh my God! Jesus, stop doing that! I can't. <laughs> oh, I hate that so much. I can't. Oh my God. Oh my God. Uh. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. What did I need? What did I need? What more? Did I I'll just go around until I find what I need because. Oh. Oh. Okay. What do we have here? I don't think I can use this. See now, even she's looking around her shoulder and like, yeah, freaked out. Cute necklace. Add something to your wardrobe. Okay, that was not part of your objectives, lady. It's not the time to take a nap. Oh! Okay, I don't know. I behind me, I think. God dang. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, just keep walking around. Keep walking around. What's this? There's something in the drawer. Found a key. Uh, uh, oh. Okay, the, the, it was a very low sound because it was in the very end of the hallway. Something tells me I can't exit with this. Is there anything to eat? I guess not. Last time I went here, the screen went all wobbly and all. So I thought that was me interacting, but that was the ghost spawning. Uh, where do I need a key for? Where do I need a key? Key. God, I hear more steps than my own. I swear to God, that is so freaky. <laughs> Maybe that's just me, but that is so freaky. Now I only need to find a closed compartment somewhere. And we are good to go. No problem. Oh, I, I don't dare swallowing even. Guess I have to find this stuff. Oh yeah, this is the entrance. Okay, where is there a closed... Uh, uh, <laughs> closed compartment somewhere. There has to be a closed compartment somewhere. <laughs> oh, I wasn't in here yet, maybe. Oh, in the start I was. Boring picture. I don't think I can use this. There's something in here for sure. This is the only place I haven't been. Yeah, use the key. There we go. Clothes, clothes. And a cross thing. That was a pling. Maybe a pling. A pling of success. Okay, so let's go out of here before we get possessed or something. <laughs> Guess we, we get to exit now or? Guess I have to find this stuff. Okay. What do we do with this stuff then? What were we supposed to do with this stuff? <laughs> I don't rec remember seeing a door here. Was there always a door here? A rider at the labyrinth. I assume it unlocked. Oh, okay. So for, oh, what the? Why, why is there someone that looks like me or is that me or or what is going on here it's probably a mirror and we seem to enjoy ourselves quite a bit that is so weird <laughs> that is so very weird so we have to find out where we can go So, so this level is filled with mirrors. You can see it more clearly now on both sides. But why is it filled with mirrors? Ah, cross. If I remove this cross, this place is going to be even more haunted, isn't it? Only two left. Ah. But I already found three crosses, didn't I? No, I found candles. No. 
Oh, I hate this. <laughs> this is so intense. I see a cross. Here. Only one left. Keep going. Is something changing with me? No, I'm still smiling. In Animal Crossing fashion. Uh, door's locked, yeah. So, uh, so this wasn't a very straightforward labyrinth. As labyrinth shouldn't really be straightforward. It should be a little maze. So there has to be an entrance somewhere I didn't see. This is more like a main road through the labyrinth in a way. Ah, <laughs> oh, here maybe. I found a little intersection with three paths. Typically I see a reflection of the cross first. Oh my god! <laughs> I hit my head, oh my god! I was so sure there was a path there. But I guess not. Like sometimes I turn around and I see my reflection that close. Because look at that, I look far away. And here I'm so close. Oh jeez. Ah, what are we here? The last one. And now I have to find my way. Um, what I... <laughs> to the door? So either back to the house or to somewhere else, I'm not even sure. Oh my god! I'm so tense now, my own reflection startles me because I don't ex I, I was so sure there was a way there and that there wasn't and I ran into myself, basically. That can be a starting experience. Okay, so it was this way, I'm sure. Oh! <laughs> I'm so pathetic. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, take it easy. Take a breath. Take it easy. This has to be their way. This must be... Oh my god! I hate myself. Why am I so... I think it's the right way. Where have I not been? I'm starting to understand how the rental guy has been stuck there for months. I don't understand why he suddenly got teleported away. Like a bubble that blew up. But uh, I'm sure they were happy to find a way out of there in one way or another. This has to be their way. This feels different. This feels not trapped, so it has to be here. I am being trolled. I am absolutely being trolled. There was a door. Where did the door go? I found the door once. The door must have disappeared just like that dental man. I'm literally hugging the wall trying to find every possible way. Oh, I can go here. Well, this is just a... Yeah. I'm hugging the wall to find every place I can go. Now I suddenly notice there's, there's more paths to go. It felt like only three paths at once. At first it found, felt like a like one hallway. Then it felt like three paths I could go. Now I'm suddenly discovering so many paths. And it confuses me immensely. This feels familiar though from far back. Either something in here is trotting with me and moving walls and mirrors around. Or I'm extremely unlucky slash inept at navigation or both. Ah, door. Door. Found you. The door is open. I'm not even sure if it's the same one or a completely different one. Oh, where am I now? Beyond the rental house. I arrive at the ritual circle. Feels like we're floating, like the table was in the start. And it feels like very ritualistic music is playing.
Oh, place one cross here. And one object there. And somehow we know where to the area. Various objects. <laughs> now, what is this even going to, going to solve? Like, this weird bunny probably wasn't the rental bunny at all. It was probably this bunny floating around us in the shape of slender bunny. Because how would they know how to instruct us to do all these things? And not have thought of it themselves, being sucker for months. Or maybe it was, it was possessed. Something here, there, and here. Okay, so I make it in a circle, basically. I just, I thought I had to place it near the objects here, near the rocks. But I just have to make a circle of them. Makes sense. Anything else to fulfill this circle? Something in the middle, maybe? Yeah. Looks like I can perform the ritual here. Okay, everything is placed. What should I even say? That useless man just disappeared on me. <laughs> Our last here is not worried one bit. Yeah, I guess nothing. Perica Perilala Poparina Peperudo. <laughs> That's from Ocha Maja Doremi, if memory serves me correctly from my early childhood. Uh. Okay, there's the big bunny behind the rock. Hello. Earth to Umi? Oh. Are we, do we just have that much of an imagination? Is that it? Uh, Umi, huh? <laughs> it seems like the rental man is not here yet. Might as well unpack what we can. Aww. Umi is unhappy. Umi was in... Well, her daydreaming world. Oh, never mind. The door is open. Could you go check? I don't think we should go inside the house. <laughs> the end. Finished first run. Wait, is there gonna be another experience? Well, it, it goes to show that you don't need high budget to make a scary game. I found the lever, uh, I, I found the uh, library, I was about to say. The maze, the labyrinth. A bit of a hassle, <laughs> very confusing. But it also shows how easily one can get lost. Oh. Okay, that was the ghost popping up for a second. So, what happens if I start this a second time? I suppose it makes sense why Umi wasn't scared or anything because everything was just in her mind. She wanted it to be like this. <laughs> Good luck. Explains why why he's just in and out of her imagination. She just have she just has a expressive uh, mind. <laughs> a healthy imagination. So that was the room behind us that suddenly spawned. Um so yeah, that's it. Umi's adventures in her head before moving into a new, apparently creepy farm like house. Thank you so much for watching and have a pleasant night. God, I, I hate ghosts. I wanna leave.